Hey, my name is Anna and in this video we're going to check out the Symbol Resonance System. The Symbol Resonance System isolates your symbol from its stand, minimising any unwanted vibrations going into the stand and allowing your symbols to resonate more freely. This is done in a similar fashion to how the suspension on your car reduces any unwanted vibration going into the vehicle allowing for a more comfortable ride. Now, there's been a lot of hype about this product with drummers such as Benny Greb, Klaus Hessler, Kaz Rodriguez, and Aaron Spears using it. A lot of us have a few questions about it. Is it worth our attention? On one side, I totally get this product. As drummers, we spend so much time tweaking our drum tone, finding the right drum shells. What head combination do we use? How do we dampen the drums? Do we use dampening at all? So why not? give your symbols a little bit of love. But equally, they're just symbols, right? There's very little we can do to alter the sound of them. You hit the symbol and it sounds like a symbol, right? Well, that's where you might just be wrong. Let's check out some comparison clips to find out whether we can hear a difference between the product being used and not being used. Before we see how this product performs on the crash symbol, let's chat a little bit about the build quality and how to install the system. So I'm glad to report that the build quality of the CRS is absolutely solid. I have no problem using it with the hardware that I'm using on the kit just behind us. It's made from metal and inside the suspension system is made from rubber. The product's been on the kit now for a week and a half. I've used it, also some friends have used it. No complaints, happy days. And I'm glad to report that the installation onto the stands is also really simple. All you need to do is remove your symbol from its stand, then begin removing the symbol stand's seat, felt and stem. Those are the parts just above the tilty mechanism. Now's the exciting time to open the CRS's packaging. You'll find the product itself and an optional hard plastic sleeve. This is to protect your symbol stand's threads from being damaged. Next, place the CRS on the stand, tightening the screws with a normal drum key. The, the CRS adds about an inch or so to the height of your stand, so just adjust the height of your stand accordingly. Now's the fun bit where you can mount your symbol and make any final tweaks. Job done. Now let's check out some crash symbol examples and then we'll summarize my thoughts on the product. Happy days.
Okay, welcome back. How did you find the crash symbol examples? Now the funny thing is when I was recording it, I didn't notice too much of a difference, but I think that's perhaps because I had my in-ears in. Having this product without using any ear protection, I noticed a great dynamic difference and I loved it, it was really cool. Equally on the ride symbol, there was a difference in, in the tone, but the feel of the symbol was different. It felt as though the stick was more bouncy and more spongy coming off the ride cymbal. And in turn, I actually enjoyed playing the kit a lot more because I felt my cymbal sounded so much better. And I'd perhaps like describe this in terms of like uh, a percentage is perhaps a five or 10% increase in the sound I'm able to get from the cymbals. And it's noticeable enough for me to want to keep this product on the drums for their foreseeable future. I see no reason to remove the products, especially when they make creating on the drum kit more fun. I'm not sure about you, but for me, my, my love for drumming and my passion to play isn't always there. Sometimes I'm like, Ugh. So anything that can help get me closer to wanting to play the drums, I'm all for, like, amazing. I came into the video thinking like a 50 pound product it's just gonna be hype, but I don't use any hyped products on my drums. I get the drum sound I want, it's a tiny bit of dampening, boom, no fancy gadgets, none of these fancy dampening systems. So, so by doing this, I've taken a risk, but thank goodness the hype is real. Hear it, the hype is real. Woohoo! So cool. Uh, so I really encourage you, if you have the opportunity to go to your local music shop or wherever stocks them and check these out. I think with a lot of this, it's all personal. Perhaps you notice no difference, but generally because the symbols I'm using are relatively thin and washy, they are rather delicious. Hope that you've enjoyed this video. If there's anything in future videos you'd like me to cover, please pop some down in the comments and I'll get back to you. And if you've got this far, please, 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 please like and subscribe. That way we can share the message of drummy goodness and nerdiness to many more peoples. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.